Hey guys and welcome back to City Skylines, the sprawling mess of Tweetopia. I am loving this place at the moment, even though right now we are having a few issues. Oh, let's just get rid of all these clicky click click. I should have done that before we got in. Uh, the main issue that I'm noticing at the moment is we are starting to spring up uh, garbage issues all over the place. So let's come down and have a look at what's going on here. Well, we've got a full one here and we've got a full one here and this guy is emptying. So let's uh, stop that emptying. We can do something about this though and that thing that I'm going to do is down here. I have found that we have incineration plants now, which is great. It's kind of the thing that we want to do. Uh, so I'm going to put down two. No, I'm not. I'm going to put down one because that's all the money that we have for doing. This should hopefully start dealing with uh, stuff. Hopefully. Hopefully. If we can just output some of this to here, that would be good. Hopefully. Oh, excuse me. Hopefully, these guys have not got too far to go. I mean, that all they're doing is literally going out and turning around and coming back. Uh... Yeah, that appears to be the thing. We do have vans going out here, and I hope that's not to go out and around. No, they're going off to collect some garbage. That's good. My fear there was that they were going to go out, round, back, and then come down this way, which would have led to all sorts of traffic issues that we really didn't need. Talking of traffic issues that we didn't need, over this way, you will see that we've got this... Uh, this highway here and I would like to get that connected up to here but I don't want to do a T-junction no I think a T-junction would be a bit much a bit much I would like to get a Y-junction on the go if that is a thing that can actually be done uh, and as we start to get to the the statue of wealth is on fire oh wow uh, well that's not too great is it we, we could definitely have done better there we do have <laughs> all these guys blocking in the uh, the buses now <laughs> Oh, well, that's pretty cool. Well, there is disruption on the road, but that's all right. These guys at the back here didn't really get to... Uh, oh, rushing to a fire organic foods. We are go, go, go for an emergency. Let's roll, guys. Hopefully, all these guys are turning up at the right place. Uh, he has been stopped. Once again, little Timmy at the back here. Can't keep up with the big boys. Uh, oh, look, carry, carrying on. Oh, we're returning to station. Obviously, they had uh, sorting out the fire. Okay, well, any, anyway, that, that was a nice little diversion. So a couple of minutes wasted there. Uh, last time, we had got this uh, sprawling mess of high density. This isn't quite turned out as I was hoping, though it has done incredibly well. The main place is it's not done quite what I was expecting. Here is a bit of a traffic knock. Can we, can we show that? Is that a thing we can show? Uh, yeah, it's not it's not terrible, thankfully. Uh, and another thankful thing is that we've got this all on the go. So th this, um, uh, can we get rid of that? This uh, me metro system here seems to be doing incredibly well. Let's just slow down the, uh, the simulation so we can see what is going on. Obviously, with the bus stop here and all the important places like just close around, everything seems to be going all right. Uh, and they are travelling over this way towards the Mall of Moderation. They are in fact getting in on this bus stop here. Uh, what's going to happen here? Oh, the buses are nearly full already when they get here. This is a bit of a problem. Maybe this place needs another bus stop going out. Uh, I'm kind of feeling that. Should we, should we get another bus route on the go? Uh, also, one thing that I may have noticed here... Um, is there a dead end somewhere or something like that? I mean, just look how knotted this yellow line is. I'm not sure that I agree uh, with how everything is laid out here. So maybe we're going to have to do something about that. I mean, getting that yellow line, just going out and around this loop and then having other bus routes that come off it, that might be the way forward here. What's going on in the, in the tunnel? What is going on with this bit of road here? So this is definitely something we need to sort out. This, this just whole massive traffic system on the go. All right, well, we should have hopefully built up enough money here that I can go around and start doing some other things. Uh, I think we are going to pause the simulation here. Uh, that's always a good start. And we're going to bust out the bulldozer from about here. Maybe we can go back to these. Okay, that, that looks good to me. I think we can do something here. Uh, what we're going to do is start with the... Um, Highway, that's the word. We're going to start with the highway piece. Yeah, my language use. I love it so much. It does everything that I want it to do, honest. Uh, and then we're going to come out here and we're going to page up. We're going to break from the road almost immediately or break from the straight line almost immediately. And then if we can, bring this over this way. There's a point somewhere where we can actually do that. There we go. And then hopefully, if everything goes well, uh, is this on the right-hand side? We go about here and we'll come back to this we'll come back to this right the next one I want to do is this one wants to go down and 
into there. Does that look right? That does look right. Okay, good. This this should be nice. This should be nice. Uh, we want this to come. If I can get the connection here, we want it to come down this way. Uh, maybe like so. Looks good to me. Uh, we're gonna have to check that we got this the right way around. No, of course we have not. Um, which will be awkward. So that means this one actually wants to come down this way. That's fine. Uh, I don't have any mods installed on this gameplay, so we're, we're not going to be able to just reverse it in the nice modded version, um, which is a bit of a shame. But we've been doing this so I can get all my achievements. Let's, let's open up here. Which achievements do we have here? Uh, you can see that I've, I've got a few of them already, but there is definitely a, a lot of things here that we could do as well. Um, yeah, lot, lots of achievements here. So I, that, that's why I'm playing this through without any mods. Uh, I thought that would be nice. I thought it would be nice to just get get everything right. You know, getting everything right is part of the part of the charm of this game. Almost as much as trying to get this road lined up right. I mean, this is a good curve that matches that, but it's not useful when it comes to actually being able to like make a, a convincing looking road. I mean, look at that. Uh, that that's that's so short. I don't I don't I don't want to do things that are this short. Is that good? It's good enough. It's going to have to be good enough. Uh, mainly because I can't be bothered to sit here and try for hours on end to get it right. Um, which probably is a failing of a lot of my city. Uh, we're going to page down here, if we can. Uh, maybe a page down too far. Up that there, and then we get a nice, nice even run. And then if we come this way, but just turn ever so slightly. Okay, there's that one done. Now, the next thing we want to do is turn this that way. Uh, so, from about here if we can. We're going to go up and uh, no it won't. That's a bit of a shame. That is a bit of a shame. Um, maybe we did just want to use one of those funny T-junctions. I've not been able to see. It seems I've not been able to get the shape going that I wanted to get going. Um, let's just run this along here. I just kind of want it straight up to here actually and then we'll come here and oh, no that's not what I wanted. I'm sure I only pressed it once. Uh, let's get this here. Like so? No? Maybe? Uh, maybe we can come up here, press here, and then come all the way down. No, it really doesn't like that, does it? Okay, so we're going to come here and just kind of ease in there. Okay, well, we now need to be able to turn these the other way, just in case. Uh, I think we're going to start with this side. Is this the way we want to go? Let's just try and figure it out. So this one now wants to come down to here, and this one wants to go up and over. Okay, we could probably get the up and over running. Let's try and get that running first. Uh, from about here, if we can. Oh, that's going to be awkward, isn't it? Okay, let's try this straight road tool. Um, I mean, ideally, we'd like to get there, right? So we can't put it back that way. I don't know why I keep trying to pull it back. Uh, space is already occupied. Yeah, that really doesn't like that, does it? Really doesn't like that. Okay, let's try deleting this. Like, coming in on the side, getting down and in there. We could probably do that anywhere, right? The problem we're going to have is trying to get this coming across here nicely. Uh, yeah, uh, we want that there. And then, if we can, yeah, we start curving. And hopefully come down with a double stop if we can. Boom. Okay, that's nice. Not quite as smooth as I was hoping for but it's gonna it's gonna do uh, and then somewhere in here there should be a page up option just like that okay so we've got a double route on here we now need to try and get these sides to join into that so bring this back down hopefully somewhere there was a good there we go we've got a little blue bit there and then we can pull this into here it's a bit of a wonky bit Bit of a wonky bit, but we can deal with that. And then this one wants to come down and in, and we would have actually managed to make our own little custom, um, custom interchange here, which is a bit rubbish because it looks exactly like the other interchange. I want it to bend the other way if at all possible. I don't think it's going to though, is it? If we come down here on sort of this sort of angle, and then we can get in here like this. Yeah, like that. That looks good. Okay, that is a lot of space to do basically this. 
Uh, but that's okay. This is good. We should be able to rerun the uh, the simulation now, and hopefully at some point people will start going this way because this is where I want them to go. Uh, the main reason being is if we have a look over here, we're getting a bit of a traffic situation here. It's not not a massive one, and a lot of the time they are just going there. So hopefully this will mean that some people are starting to go in the other way. But it's a bit hard. There we go. There someone goes. Ooh. All right. Well, they they're using it. This is the main thing. I do uh, enjoy it when people use the things that I built. Uh, this guy is going to the plaza with picnic tables, which which should be nice. We're, we're going to watch him drive all the way down. I love the way that we get our power generation coming in here. Maybe what we want to do is get rid of these tall windmills and start using them as an ornamental thing. In fact, I think we might be doing that. Um, where, where would it go? Like commercial areas, industrial areas, stuff like that. I don't think it belongs in-house, uh, in residential. Look at that road. That might have been a bit steep. Maybe we'll come back and fix that. I don't know. I don't know. All right, so where are we going to go from here? I'm hoping we're going left. I was kind of expecting this guy to end up um, at the uh, the high-density area, but obviously not. He just wanted to get to this side of the town. Okay, he's turning into the high-density... Well, not the high-density, but the high-density of traffic area here. This is possibly my worst... Um, Worst junction. Been, I've been keeping an eye out, and this this one here and that one on the other side are terrible. Always just like absolute chop blocks. This guy seems to be making his way around town fine, though. This is definitely uh, quite a congested area. Yeah, no, it's very much a congested area. Though I'm surprised that a guy came from out of the city just to come to this plaza. I don't know. It just seems a bit weird to me. Shall we try and put a commercial area in here? We've got them all in moderation. I think we might want to flatten this bit down and just make it a little bit nicer. Because um, at the moment we're, we are packed in as tight as we can. And whilst that is nice, it doesn't... I mean, it doesn't really look nice, does it? I mean, I'd like to put some offices back here. That would be quite nice. That would then start leading up into the large area. Uh, but, I mean, maybe if we... Should we try something? This is some offices. Let's try... No, I don't want to do that. Let's get this one. Let's just try putting some offices here. I'm not sure if that's the best idea. I'm not sure if that's the best idea. I mean, we could maybe, if we open this up, get another metro line on the go. I mean, look at that. That's almost perfect, like, right there. Oh, I'm not allowed to put it there. Oh, that is a shame. That is a shame. Do we have any sort of twisty system? No. Nope. Well, we're going to have to deal with that as it is then. Uh, this should be fine, though, because there is a bus stop here. There is a bus stop here. And let's start dealing with some other stuff, actually. I know I was just talking about the, the commercial sector, but one of the things that we really need to do is start addressing our bus lines. Our bus lines are terrible. So, open, open. This yellow one in particular seems to just go everywhere. Um, I don't want that on this. So I'm not sure that we want to do this. I mean, we could definitely do with breaking it down into separate bus routes. Like, have a centralised bit, and then we have a bus route that comes out to here, and a bus route that comes out to here. Uh, one that goes around all this stuff and connects everyone up. Uh, so, where would we put such a traffic hub? Where would we put such a traffic hub? I'm thinking maybe on this corner of the sprawl here. We've got the high school. Oh, excuse me. Still seem to be having some troubles. Uh, we've got the high school there, so maybe that's a, a good way to to start. Uh, that's the elementary school. So I'm thinking the transport hub should be... Well, it needs to be somewhere near this. Definitely needs to be somewhere near this. Can we put it on the other side? Is that a thing? Uh, it doesn't really... It's not really needed on the other side. Okay, I think I'm going to start by wiping out some road. Let's start with a bit of this. Okay, do we want to take it on and off of the roundabout here? Do you think that's going to make any any impact into what actually happens on the roundabout? It's one of my busier intersections, but it would also be good to have roads coming in here. Okay, let's check it out. This, this pathway didn't go anywhere. Is this actual pathway or is this something someone else has put in? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. No, it's actual pathway. I, I don't know where that goes. I've obviously destroyed it. Uh, look, it goes over here. Oh, well. Okay, fine. Uh, yeah, so, what are we doing here? We are going to... Yeah, a nice little two-way road that just comes off here. I'm not sure if this is really... There's not enough room here, is there? Nowhere near enough room. 
Okay, so after looking around and deciding what we're going to do, what we're actually going to do is wipe out this entire corner here. It's not a click and drag off. Uh, and this area is going to eventually become our... Oh, I've just noticed that we've got um, electric lines here. Yeah, oh, oh, we're about to lose electricity everywhere. This is not good. Redundant systems are needed. Is that better? Hopefully everyone's going to chill out now. I hope everyone's going to chill out now. Uh, we need to dezone the area. Dezoning is strong. And hopefully when we swap this bit for another um, roundabout, we should be able to get everything in as nice as we want to. Okay, it's time to start thinking about how we're going to do this. I would like to take it off of, maybe off of the main highway. That would be a nice way to come in and out. Um, also off of this place. We're going to want a few roads put in. Now, our main, our main point here is that we want to have a flow from one end to the other, right? Um, <coughs> so I am thinking we're going to come in off this one. Maybe here. Let's just put a road down before we uh, dither our way into not doing anything. Uh, and a little bit of a one-way road this way. Um, then we want a down. And can we connect it up to there? That's a bit of a slanty side. Um, let's just try and get this right. We want this to match up, right? Something like that should enable us to uh, kind of pull over here. Oh, that's no good. I've done it to the completely wrong size. Uh, let's just carry on moving this up. Something like that. And then I'll be able to just kind of clip into the edge. Um, yeah, like that. And then we can just delete everything else. Brilliant. And then if we can change this into a one-way road. Yeah, I don't see any way that this is going to turn into trouble. <laughs> Honest. Uh, right, so we want also a one-way road coming down here. And then hopefully connecting up to there. And then we can have little downward systems like this, where we can have different buses coming into different places. Yeah, I like this. I like this a lot. This is a different size gap. That's fine. That's fine. Who cares? Uh, right, the first thing we're going to do is pause the simulation for a second. Uh, I'm going to wipe out this yellow line. And I mean completely. Just nail it. Uh, well, how do we do that properly? Uh, we should be able to find a bus somewhere. A yellow bus. Let's have a look around. There's a yellow bus. Uh, modify line, delete line. Boom. Gone. Okay. So the first thing we want to do is we want a bus system going from this drop here to in here. Uh, maybe we want to move our bus depot as well. Does anyone know where we put the bus depot? I'm not quite sure where I put the bus depot. It is there. If we can move it, that'd be great. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move it. Uh, something like that. Okay, sweet. And we've got some room here for some extra people. Let's uh, let's just zone these guys up. Uh, we don't want high density. We want low density. Because we are in the massive sprawl that is this sprawl. <laughs> okay, uh, the next thing is buses, bus routes. Uh, so we're going to go from here. Well, I think we want to start it somewhere in here. So we're going to start here and we're going to come down. And the first thing we're doing is coming this way to start picking up some people. Uh, we cannot go that way. I just realised that's a dead end. That's not the best. It's not the best. Uh, we want to bring this up and across to here and then literally just back here. This isn't quite the route I would have taken, but that's okay. That's all right. Uh, right. So with that, we can now start nailing the other thing. So this is uh, Metro 2 Station, right? So let's let's get this. All right. That's uh, that's pretty good there. That's what that one's doing. Right. The next one we want to get rid of is possibly this Burgundy line, as it appears to be completely confused. What we're going to do with the Burgundy line is get it to go from one of these points come down around the outside here, maybe with this little in inside put here, uh, up into here and then back into the thing. Yeah, I think that looks good. It's close to what the Burgundy line is doing already, but I'd like to tidy it up. I would really like to tidy it up. Um, okay, so let's try this again. It's going to be a lot of uh, bus placements today, a lot of bus placements today. We're going to come in and the first thing we're doing is going over this way. No, actually, the first thing we do is we're going this way, uh, and we're going to stop here. Maybe we're going to go around this commercial sector over this way. 
Uh, need to have a stop outside the Statue of Wealth. Uh, we want to come along this way. We really did want to go in there for a second, didn't we? It's the only way these guys are going to be able to actually get anywhere. So if we come like this, then hopefully these guys can either walk down here or get whatever bus route we've got going on this side. Uh, and then we want to come down here to this. Rip it up this long line here. Uh, maybe we want to stop, but I don't think we've got many uh, crossing points here. So, I don't know. We're going to put this in for future proofing. Because, you know, future proofing is important. Uh, come around here for this little turn. Come down. Do we want to do this middle bit? I kind of want to get a bus somewhere on this middle route here. I mean, something like that would be good. The problem we're going to have now is trying to get here. Okay, I see what's going on. I see what's going on. Well, maybe we want to stop at the same place here. Maybe we want to actually get this one doing this stop. And then we come back here. Okay, that kind of works. That kind of works. Uh, we want to change the colour of the line. That is a thing. Most definitely that is a thing. Uh, unfortunately, I don't know how to do it without actually coming out of the... Placing the route markers and kind of doing this. But we'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. There was a burgundy somewhere, I don't know, maybe in here and something like that. Uh, what are we going to call this? This is the Western Residential Line. Okay, that's pretty good. So now it looks like we want to do the Eastern Wes Residential. Yes, Residential Line. Uh, I am a little bit... You see where this green one goes up into this little mungy section over here? I think the yellow one should be the one doing that. I'm going to delete this line, and I'm going to start putting in extra bits on this yellow line. Just just one of these. Oh, no. Just one up here. Everybody seems to be able to get to that point. This, this road can get to it. This road can get to it. Everybody seems to be happy. We will allow that. Okay, next thing we're going to do is to get this sprawling mess done. Um, so where do we want to make sure that we've definitely got a bus route? Uh, I'm going to start... Do we want to start right the way down here? I mean, there's a, there's a... Yeah, I think I am. I'm going to go there, and then we're going to go this way. Everything will be all right. Everything will work out fine. Uh, there is a flaming building there. I'm not sure what building. Uh, I'm trying to line up my bus stops with all my pathways here. I think it would be a nice, nice thing to have, like, walking routes between my bus stops. Um, even if it does mean that we end up, like, doing little things like this where... These three are almost redundant from each other. Uh, people could all, uh, always just walk on up. But that's fine. That's fine. Uh, we do not want to do the, uh, this side of the town. That, that's the major thing about this place. Even though we're coming down to this main line, I think what we actually want to do is come up here now. Or do we want to get... No, this will be the last thing we do before we go down to there. Uh, so let's carry on up this way, get another stop here. We're just going to use this as a, a rounding up people... I've done this completely wrong, haven't I? Look, watch. If we come back and just start here, first thing we do is come down and do the school run. Okay, so anyone coming from here changes their bus and goes straight to school. Yeah, that's a much better idea. Uh, and then maybe we want to come down here? Or do we want to just go straight across, do this place? Yeah, I think there. And then we can come down to here. One at the end by the pathway, uh, one here and one here, uh, and then we're going to carry on up this way. This is going to be quite a long residential run. I'm not sure if I want it quite as long as it is, but we're going to have to make do with it. I'm just trying to think whether we want it in this section here or whether we want to bring them to the bus stop now. Uh, as he will probably be the only bus that's ever doing anything like this, I think we will send it this way, here, here, and then... Ooh, should we should we have one for luck here somewhere? I mean, we want people going to the cemetery, whatever this building is. Uh, okay, I think that's a good run there. This is the Eastern Sprawl. Okay, we can definitely deal with this being the Eastern Sprawl. So that let's get on this here. Okay, not too much more to go. I like this pink line as it is. It would be nice if it came up to the uh, uh, the depot here, but I kind of think this is going to stay as it is. It's just a nice little circular that does the, these guys and this guy. Uh, it's the same with this uh, this green line up here. This is the high density red uh, high density red red. Same with this guy here. It's the uh, high density register. 
residential. Wow, I'm having serious troubles with my words today. Uh, yeah, no, this kind of all looks all right. Uh, I would like to get a final bus route going in here. Let's let's just make sure that that is a thing. Um, okay, let's do it from here. He's really not going to be going anywhere other than there. We don't want to create on that side. We do want to create on that side. Totally my fault. Uh, and then we want to come down here, just straight into this. This is all this guy does. He comes around and he does this little industrial area here. Uh, before, do we want to stop him here? We'll stop him there before going back up to there. And it should be as simple as that. So we're going to make some... Uh, make a commercial stop like that. And then that should be sweet. Is there is there anywhere we could get an extra extra stop in having it look like that? Maybe up here. This is a little under underutilized. Okay, like that. Brilliant. Okay. I'm loving it. All right, I, I'm really enjoying how we've done the, these bus routes here. I would like to come back and obviously make this place look a little bit better. Uh, we need to maybe get some footpaths going between the zones. We've got like these little walking zones here. So maybe if we just quickly, for now, as a temporary fix, fill these in. Then people can walk across, use the, uh, the little pedestrian crossing there, and everyone should be nice and happy. I'm not sure how they get from one spot to another. Uh, is anyone going to be using these? I don't think so straight away. We, it would be nice to like watch some of these lines roll out. Let's, let's watch this guy. Uh, and in fact, let's watch this guy, because he is the first of the sprawl buses, I believe. Uh, so there is no one at, this, uh, at the, the school. Uh, that surprised me. That surprises me very much. Uh, what else do we have going on? So this guy is now going to try and uh, go down around this way. If we can click this now, that would be good. Uh, we've got a movement of people going across the road. There is a lot of people here. I do wonder where they go. Uh, I presume they're only going for, um, for a little walk, maybe going from work to home. So we've got a lot of buses all close to each other. I know this is kind of due to the fact of how I... Um, set out the route and released them all at once. Uh, I am hoping they always seem to go in pairs because this guy back here he's going to have no passengers at all I wonder why that is a thing how do we reduce this down? Maybe reduce the money that we're giving them Alright, so we're coming around. I, th I think that's a, enough of a thing here. Uh, and we are going to wander down here. As I say, thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. A bit transport heavy today. Uh, and next time we're going to have to be like spending some time getting our uh, a little bus hub over here. Looking all nice and like somewhere that people can actually use. Oh, wow, look at this. Oh, yeah, look at this. Where did they come from and where are they going? This is what I want to know. Where did they come from where are they going? But anyway, I will see you next time when we're going to do all these things. Bye! There's another fire on the go over there.